is going to give you a lot of room. Already in the mid here, 100 Thieves is trying to pressure quite quick. That spike's going to be working its way slowly through Garage. Once Market makes its move, that's when the hit's going to be coming in. And the drone's still oh, going no. to be first as they're getting halted a little bit here by Sentinels. Yeah, the, the smoke just had just a sliver, right? And they were able to see through that and pick off a couple of members of 100. Oh, oh. sick. Oh, man, Ethan and Asuna, they got messed up. And then the Judge from 10s getting the first one on to steal. We mentioned Austin was also still pretty weak. As they try to figure out how do, how do they get past the defenses from Sentinels here? I mean, they're, they have everything they need on this eco. Beautiful job as they're still trying to taunt Cat here. Sick comes up with two quick ghost kills and Shazam's gonna look to finish one in so grows a position. There's one for him and here comes Sick to finish this one off. Jump and judge. Now Dapper's gonna get that one. A pretty quick and easy cleanup round for Sentinels. Zom's ready for the paranoia, ready to call in the cavalry here to come over towards the A site, and he starts hearing footsteps as they begin the initiation. Steel has gotten onto the site. He's going to get the spike down for now. While slightly, it seems like 100 Thieves have control of the site. They're in excellent post plans as well. They have decent control, at least enough to be close by. Austin is for tree, but the paranoia comes out. Ten's dashing in. He's got a judge in his back pocket. The turret's there and steal. 100 mm. Thieves across the board just most sent. We're putting the wall up here to get one of the rounds, and now they're actually probably going to work off of this with the rest of the team going up towards cap. But it may be a bait. I think the other interesting thing. Okay, so Sick goes in aggressive, understands that that's likely where they're going to want to hit. They drop tens on the swing. He's not going to get a chance to do anything, but Zombs is. As he gets a second one as well, the spike goes down. You see them all starting to rotate over. They can squat on that, understanding where the play's coming from. But running back has been used. Sick goes in, doesn't get anything. Zombs still there. He's going to drop to Nitro as well. Nitro just continues to go off for a 2v2 as they try to get on to A. Nitro and Hiko, who would the fans want up more? Well, it looks like Shazam on the side of Sentinels. Hiko dives in to find one, and he thinks he's got a bit of room to work with, but Dapper is always on the lurk. 38 seconds left, there's a good chance that's where the hit's going to be. Hiko using the Hunter's Fury to clear out that area of the map as his team tries to get in. Asuna gets the first one on the Zoms. Sick, excuse me. Now Shazam's in a great spot to blow it up. It Shazam was already good for two. Steel manages to get through. He's going to drop in the spikes up there too, Rip. Things have gone so sideways for 100 keys. Hiko trying to save this one. Clutch Master coming in. 2v1 situation, sees one towards screens, and Shazam has had every pressure coming from 100 Thieves because they have the lockdown, because they have the showstopper out of Asuna, they push into where they expect that aggression to come, but it's actually the middle of the map again. Much like the pistol, the paranoia, the wall, Asuna doesn't get a chance to use the showstopper. As soon as he brings it online, he gets ripped down. Ten still trying to stay alive. He's got the blade storm. He's not going to be able to use it either. Ethan, Ethan trades it out and equalizes things at four apiece. Dapper is still looking through the wall. He could have a decent flank coming in here if he chooses market in just a few. The rest of Sentinels is held off. And 100 Thieves are working this one quite slow right now. Sick coming up with two during the chaos of Hunter's Fury. There's the run it back into the site. He's going to see one Boathouse, but focus on the spike. What a choice for the 3k there coming from Sick on the Phoenix. Now it's Nitro in the back of Boathouse. A rough one here as he throws down the heal pack. And I don't know if he's going to be able to get out of this one alive as they pinch him from all sides. No, they're really, I mean, full send A, draw everything off, then steals there with the lockdown. It might be good for something, but Zoms is just left unchecked. Riv, Tens gets one from up in heaven as well with the operator. Oh! And then there was, there was the, there was the last one, right? A flawless round out of Sentinels. They're clicking on all scary, Riv, because Sentinels, by process of elimination, have a really good idea of where the hit's gonna come. And then the lockdown there confirms everything. They're gonna funnel onto the site. Asuna, one of the first ones there. Ethan waiting in mid. Is he going to see Tiles? He looks back right at the right time. Back and forth. Ten's able to trade with the off. But Asuna coming up huge there. And the kills are just a flurry in the site. Spike's going to be able to get planted now. Asuna, Kiko, and Ethan versus Dapper. What an execute onto the site. They didn't like mid. They feel it out towards A. And they actually capture Sentinels spread out enough to take a good post plant here. Let's see what Dapper can do. I mean, the, the thing is, Dapper has so much oh. money, <laughs> so much money, <laughs> money. He could have fully comes out and they see that nobody's coming. Look at how quickly they start funneling back towards B, understanding that that's not where the hit is. You're running out of time. Tens is already there waiting with open arms as he takes care of steel. 100 Thieves again. They keep looking to make something happen across the map. And Sentinels have just been reading him like a book.
Yeah, looking for that mid flank again. It was almost in the same spot. Zombs again in the back of the site. Sick. A 3k. Not a sick. Using the run it back. Doing out everything. And he gets a kill. There's so much value there. Nitro oh, no. peaked it. That would have almost been the crossfire. I think they were just off by a few feet there. Drone's gonna see tens down to 10 wow. HP here. So Sentinel's taking a hit. That's exactly what 100 Thieves needed after losing Nitro. And the push up's gonna make Dapper know what's in mid. Who's he's gotta fight? The trade comes in from over the shoulder. Steel's wow. able to take down Dapper in a 2v1. Big kill there, too. Wow. And it seems to be getting better. Asuna takes care of Shazam. The spike hanging out over in wine. They're gonna flip them. They're not gonna flip the map. Okay. Well, there's just. A lot of info that's gathered there, but at this point, they're kind of committed. Asuna show stopper connect. The Hunter Fury is going to be used in Hiko as well to clear out Heaven. But tens, man, fancy footwork, and he gets the kill with ten health, continuing to be a nuisance. And Seal again on the flank, he might blow this thing up. You've got Hiko and you've got Asuna. Well, you had Hiko and you had Asuna, and they're not around any longs being traded around. Ethan's got a rifle as well. Dapper. One of the first lines of defense. Excellent paranoia. Oh. My goodness. Sitting ducks, Riv. Patience, Doug. It's all the patience that Sentinels has right now. They're just waiting for 100 Thieves to cross their cross their aim. Make contact. Here it is. Steel doing what he can. No Feeling way. pretty good. He's going to say, you got to come to me if you want to make it happen for now. With these frags. Ethan putting up one here for pistol round. He's gonna get that first blood on the Zom. Shazam answers back to even it up, Doug. And now we're at 4v4. Dapper has a decent idea of where Nitro is, too. Dapper certainly weak. Excellent flash Ooh. just in the nick of time. Sick comes out of nowhere to open things up. But Asuna says he can do a bit of the same. Shazam takes care of him as he continues to funnel onto the site. Shazam! Green shots again, dude. He's already got three on the round. Might even get more, yeah. What a ref few moments ago. Ah, I mean, what do you do? Not a whole lot, because you've probably already faced tens in the round, sick in the round, and you're like, well, we six zombs, tens up front. And there's tens to start it off once again. That's the first blood as we get into round 15, a possible last round. They get into the site, run it back here for sick, as 100 Thieves has just run for the hills on this one to try and get the retake in. Is six already going to call that there's a few heaven, and Sentinels know even more now. That's excellent swing there from 100 Thieves. I like the patience out of Nitro, ensuring that that is indeed where the hit's going to go. The spike's gone down. Now he's going to pull off. Zom's in a great spot here. There's no flank coming through from the middle of the map. So for 100 Thieves, they're just going to have to fight their way through this thing. Asuna, already good for one with the Stinger. And the thing is that the gun advantage is so heavily in favor of Sentinels here. You kind of imagine it, it's pretty difficult for them to pull this off, and you're seeing it play out, right? To be usually on that Shazam. Uh, otherwise, now it is Tens who's going to be doing that and happy to get it down. They take it for now, though, and they start to push around. Great defense by Steel as they know it might be a fake. And now it's going to be 100 Thieves trying to pinch in, Doug. This looks wow. real grim now for Dapper. It absolutely does. Left alone in a 1v4. The thing is, Steel, Ethan... Weak. So it's and maybe doable is a strong word. I guess technically it's doable, but it's just a very difficult situation here if you're dapper. I like how he's trying to reposition the sniper mentality. Get a kill. Reposition. They're in one v one spots. Dog, this could be bad. They, they if can't. they don't move, they're good. But yeah. they're right now in one v one spot. Okay. okay. Huh. Whew. If they, if I thought, he I thought can, Hiko was going to move. You've got Steel up top. Nitro going in. He's going to be the first one there. He's going to drop. Steel does too. They've gotten onto the site, Riv. Nitro and Steel feeling a little Rambo-ish there against the Eco. And now it's going to be a few weapons in the hands of Sentinels as they get the chance to defend. Asuna getting pushed out by the Roomba. And post plant almost about to be on par now. 50 seconds in. Got it. All right, so 300 in the pocket. This is going to be good for Sentinels if they can pick up more. Yeah, Ten's bro. coming up huge. And this is so big for Sentinels from a financial perspective. If they they really they throw the, the half in the bucket, right? If they can do this financially to hundred thieves, unreal, a thrifty round, a beautiful one at that. From it's gonna go through first. But look at the aggression from hundred thieves through garage. Shazam's waiting there on the other side. He's gonna drop six swings. Six oh Phantom is just filthy. Sentinels just death balling mid right now. They feel okay with that. They say. If we have more, then it doesn't matter what they're coming at us with this in this eco round. Zoms, nice kill on the steal there as they just keep cleaning these ones up. Nitro will be found in sight. 
Being tens being tens. That can't just enter a site regularly. <laughs> and they are almost all but in tens. It's a little late with the spike there as they had to pick it up, but they're going to be good to go as they have post plant already set up. And you see they're sticking to the site, right? Like oftentimes you'll see teams plant down and then play for C long, go all the way back to the bottom with C long and then play off of that. Kind of force the defending team to play through chaos as they're trying to get the retake. But they, with the confidence that they've shown in map one and so far in map two, for them to fully stick onto the site, you can tell, Riv, 100 Thieves, look at how patiently they're playing this out. They might not even try. Yeah, I don't... Oh, oh that no. could have been a possibility. Yeah, everybody's too far away at this point, though. You're right. Weapons to be saved, and they're considering very yeah, early today, that you know. this is nice. going to be tough. Sentinels are feeling on their game. A drop. And I like this response from Asuna. Understanding the aggression was going into the garage. He's going to push his lane to A long and get a kill. Ethan follows up with one as Ooh. well. Sheriff's coming online, baby. Feels good when you hit those laser shots. Dapper, however, on his patented lurk. Now leave out on the B site. He does have that gate up. And threw it up to kind of fake over towards the A side. And they do get an ultimate out of Ethan Whoa. there. So he'll be trying to hold down on A. They have completely faked out one. But yep. it is going to be Steel waiting to see if he's right. And he makes the call, I believe, with that spike. And you can see Ethan now pack it up on A and head towards C. Oh, wow. Just, just a fraction of a second late for steel and then not able to land the kill anyway doesn't delay the defuse doesn't get the kill doesn't have any armor either and at this point if you're still you just got to buy time for ethan to show up you can't afford to lose your life in a situation like this oh my god the gun barrel gives everything away zoms is so weak as well now ethan's gonna show up zoms in a brutal spot here and he's got some utility so he's got a chance but oh, he's got to respect it, and Steel's it? just going to stick it. So well played by 100 Thieves. What are the chances? They're a little version of a slow warp nade, right? They can get back in there. There's multiple ways to do it. Nitro Steel now stepping up big as they get nice. a little bit of a push out and don't feel deterred by Sentinel's aggression here at the start of the round. Spike on 10s is all the way back here with an operator. And they're just looking for a pick. We got a minute left, and I think they're going to try to use the rest of this time. Potentially, I, I mean, I think priority number one here is keep the op alive, or at least keep it safe. Yep. And if you can, if you can get, I mean, but you, you've got to get what at least two to make it feel comfortable, right? Like maybe. Yeah. And with the game so close, that's that. that and if he chooses to blast out, Steel will follow the Hunter Fury from Shazam. Oh no! Tens gets the pick on the steel. That's huge. Zombs gets one on the Ethan as well. Things have gone sideways. Hundred thieves just have a few members left. The retake, the retake is absolutely stuffed. What? They go to left. plant. They leave the Five site. Plans. Then use Hunter's Fury. Oh my word! They're just toying with Hundred Thieves right now, and what time they're supposed to enter, and what they're going to find once they get into the site. Everybody had walked out when Hunter's Fury was being used. What a play here from Sentinels, and they are going to take this round handily, only losing Dapper as this one ticks out. He goes. 100 Thieves once again at a disadvantage early. They found my wire. Just ready for everything, honestly. It's mm -hmm. been such an impact mm -hmm. to have Tens on a team in the tournament. He is just making changes everywhere here when the team needs it. Shazam. Drop steel, so they have a little bit of knowledge that the map is open, but behind them could be a problem here. We'll see what can happen from Asuna as he makes his way around again in a site for sentence. Yeah, but Shazam is wise to it. Look at how far up Shazam is gone. Nitro tried getting it. Shazam, get there was that flank taken off the board. Hiko was there alone. There was, a, there was a moment in the first half where you needed to see something, right? Like... I'm... Not sure what that noise was. That's that was me. I mean, there's Sentinels just look so good, Riv. And, and I think the the tricky thing is here for Hundred Thieves, specifically on Ascent. You want if you can get to seven five, right? You've got a chance. You you look good going into the second half, but Sentinels just just don't seem to be giving up an inch. There's the Rolling Thunder that we've been waiting on for as long as we have. That's gonna push them off the site. Ethan's gonna follow up. As the first, Hiko joins in on the action as well. Excellent post plants 
from Sentinels, the operator in the hands of 10. Excellent smoke, but he slings just the hair too early. Shazam gets up close and personal as well. Night 10s, excuse me, with the blade storm hunting, looking for Nitro. He's gonna no. get it a 3k for no. him. Sentinels playing tight. He takes so much space away. Great flash though, as Asuna gets one. They know he's low. They're gonna try to focus on this. He says, all right, I'm in there then. As the flash comes out from Nitro, they try to work off that as Ethan comes up big. We've seen him do work from the garage hall. A very comfortable position for him as now Sentinels have to call a bit of an audible here and they're gonna be on the fly for the rest of this strap. Right here. Now here's the thing, Zoms. So Zoms has it from the shadows. They could flip the map or Shazam can just use the Hunter Spirit to try to clear out that elbow space instantly. Does tag up one, Zoms follows up, isn't enough to get the kill, but Ethan again from Garage gets the third on the round, dueling Hunter Spirit, and it looks like this is gonna be a bit more effective as Shazam drops. The aggression, yeah, look at them, look at Garage. Look how far Sick has already taken up space. As they funnel onto A, he can be devastating on the flank, especially if they don't swing back to it in time. But so far, Asuna and Hiko gotten onto the site just fine. Tens and Zoms, done. Sick and Dapper left alone. There's the flank, it's given away. Might be able to get that kill. Great flash, great, better turn away. As he gets the kill, isn't able to get the second. Dapper's left alone. Out of committal on A, so they have to distribute over to BC. Dapper. Oh, Dapper! Hiko, Hiko takes him out. Great shots from the Spectre. He really could have blown that thing up. They have garage control, and Asuna with the Vandal. One of the feet, I think he's the only full rifle on yeah. the team at this point. Just trying to get more ult orbs, trying to get closer to that showstopper. Sick alone here. He's got a Spectre, so he's upgraded a weapon. And they're not super healthy. He's going to isolate the gunfight too, but Ethan to clear and see if there was a push. This is going to be lively action at C, and Asuna starts us off with the first blood. The paranoid was there. Sick is all the way down at the bottom of C long, so keep an eye on him. He really can make this thing go entirely sideways. Ethan's gonna drop first, steal on the swing through the garage. He's gonna drop as well as Sick continues to be a nuisance and sure that nobody's big on the flank. The spike has gone down. Nitro with three. That's huge. Sick here in a 1v3. Both drop, it looked so promising for 100 Thieves and Sentinels respond at just the right time. They hit where it hurts. There's a rolling thunder, but Asuna looking to get this back in favor of 100 Thieves. He gets a couple of picks, drop things down. To a 3v3, he's got the showstopper as well. Tense looking to go big Spike for planted. Sentinels, and so far, so good. The spike goes down. Number advantage Remaining. in favor of Sentinels, and oh my gosh, Tense is just a man possessed. Dapper does the riv, and he's got the Hunter's Fury. Okay, takes a step back. Keep an eye on that ultimate. Okay, they're getting onto the site. There's the Hunter's Fury that we were talking about. But the paranoia came out. He got enough to get and another. Steal. Yes. <laughs> Looks like they're gonna be taking it now. They feel good off of Sam. Confidence there. It's gonna be Asuna holding the alt, waiting for somebody to come through for the showstopper so he can stop it in its tracks. That's nice. what is he fires it in the toes, finds it. They're gonna be forced to get out of this one. Sentinels oh, may not be able to make it work. Yeah. Oh, they tried. They went back and forth. It seems like they miscommed as Shazam was leaving. And it's um. Dude, they're full sending, but there's a judge on the other side. Dapper playing in the cage, good for one. Backs up Gosh. and uses their null theft. That's gonna give everything away. And then look at the pinch again. Look at the pinch from Sentinels. They've gotten all the way through into the spawn. 100 Thieves are gonna have to push through that to get to the rest of the map. A round where 100 Thieves commits everything to this, everything to the same spot. You get the oh, biggest return on investment down. from the neural uplink. Shazam, it's a shotgun round. Holy moly, Sentinel's coming up huge this time. Dapper starting it off. Neural uplink. Shazam knowing exactly where he needs to be on the early push. They are trying to send a message to 100 Thieves with each of these rounds that they're able to get under their skin. And now Hiko is left to clutch this one versus three. I will say, given Hiko's antics, he's probably due for one. Right, well, it's, it's been a while. But kind of 1v1, knowing he'd probably face two people checking that jump. And you see, and the problem is... Oh my word. They take so much early space, right? Look at how far up Dapper is already. If, the, if it's an A hit, they punch in. Look at how far up Shazam is down A long. If it's a B hit, they can pinch in. They've just suffocated 100 Thieves the last couple of rounds. It's going to funnel them to go right into the lap of tens on the other side of the smoke as devastating of a player as he can be 
Looks like he might be given away by the drone. He swings at just the right time, and Ethan responds with it beautifully. Dapper, as we mentioned, on the plane. Zom's on the site. Dapper's oh. there. The spike goes down. You feel the pressure, right? Like, I think they start to take too long. You see it followed up. Sick pushing his way through, and he gets a pick as well. The Hunter Spear from Hiko on the push back, right? Like, understanding that when aggression comes in from one side, it's likely coming in from another as well. Invest that to push it back and gets the kill on the 10s with the op. That's going to open up the map for 100 Thieves. Catching him in the rotation a little bit here. Looking at the off angles, 100 Thieves gets the better of Sentinels as Nitro takes down Dapper with a Sova. Firing across the map. Ethan, blind. Or taking down Sick as he's blind, I should say. In the 4v2 now as Sentinels try to capitalize on a round that could end the game, but looks like it will be extended one more by 100 Thieves here. Big there, and then for Nitro to get that Rolling Thunder online off the spike plant. That's big. Sentinel's just down to Zoms in a 1v4. And and I think the the tricky thing is, and it, I know we can't... Well, he's dealing damage, and that's exactly yeah. what I was about to, to highlight, is the financial situation for Sentinels, right? Like... 100 Thieves, you know they've lost the last couple. I don't know what their what their bankroll looks like. But for Sentinels, I believe they should be able to buy full here as well. I'm just concerned for 100 Thieves, this is getting very expensive. That was a great job by Zoms to make sure he wants. As they're still all across the map, this is going to be a scatter take. See if it works for him. Oh, no! The Rolling Thunder was there, and Dapper takes care of Austin as he blast passed across. But Nitro... We're good for the retake. Dapper drops. The spike's going to go down. Numbers advantage in favor of 100 Thieves as it looks like it's getting worse. But Zoms has to go big there. It's just Shazam alone in a 1v2. They've taken post plants down. See long. Shazam with an opportunity here to win the map, to win the series for Sentinels. But no, we're going to play another round as Ethan comes up big for 100. Magic. And now with one minute left in the round, the showstopper of Asuna is into the site. Sentinels is playing the first short hard retake as they wait for everyone to get in position. Here comes tens from A. Shazam one point away from the Hunter Siri. The paranoia comes out. Asuna playing the ankle roll. Asuna good for one. Dancing around the box as he tries to get the second detection. Nitro that does it. Tens with the op gets one and it gets traded out. Zombs in a 1v3 to avoid overtime. He's got some utility. If he doesn't have at this point his friends. Cover going out. Now he's known. Yeah, and the, the, the spike just continues to tick away, right? If you're Zombs, you, you gotta go. You just don't have very many options. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to overtime. Let him know that party's coming. Great jump by him, and he will find Sick to start. That's gonna be another oh. Ethan almost for three. Right on his right. He no. has the angle. He has the kill. And Ethan shuts down Sentinel C Long. What an insane performance out of Ethan. Coming up huge when his team needed him the most. Steel was game yep. just comes to a screeching halt. Now it looks like 100 Thieves want to make a play towards C. The spike gets picked up. Left. Ethan gets the shot onto Dapper. Again, the paranoia is going to come out. Counter smoke. The smoke is the flash is there. Excuse me. Oh, 10! Up close and personal. Shazam's good for one as well. As 100 Thieves are just down to one. That was a pie to the face as 10s came out of the smoke there for Asuna. Oh, my Ten word. Seconds. The quits goes to the next one. Coming from spawn. We're going into a second overtime as Shazam. Here we go. They're fully committing on to A. Asuna. Asuna's got a chance to do something special there. He gets one. Nitro gets another one as well. As it drops down to a 4v3, make that a 4v2 in favor of 100 Thieves. Nitro anchoring things down on the site. The spike goes down. Tens, who was watching. Now knowing they could yeah. be surrounded. Embarrassing. Wow. Oh, man. Ethan drops. Sick anchoring down Garage. He's going to have... Her ball as well, and then you see Dapper on the flank. So even if they do manage to get the spike down, Dapper can blow things up. Spike goes down. Sick. Good for Asuna. Only two members remain for 100 Thieves. It's just Hiko now. Hiko's not going to be around for long. Riv, we're playing another one. Neither team willing to give in here. Spike planted. They have reach utility. Oh no, Hiko goes down right away! The Sova is so necessary for the retake. How will this work? 400 Thieves now as they try to get back in. Steel is already injured as he's up in heaven smoked oh. off. The rest of the team needing to make commotion from lower. Steel's tagged up. 
And you see Zom's down low, waiting for that push to come through. And here comes Counter Paranoia's at almost the exact same time. They still can't find a way into the site. Here goes Asuna. He's gonna go in first. He's gonna get ripped down as well. But the rest of 100 Thieves seem to be just fine. Tens and Shazam flipping it back. That would have been chaos for them. 100 Thieves may have been able to capitalize, but a lot of that went out the window with Hiko going down. What a push for Sentinels to identify that kill. And this is what's... Not wise to the fact that two members just on the other side of the smoke, Ethan's down. The spike is there as well in the hands of Hiko. He's still alive. Thing is, I don't know that he saw anyone else. So you see Sentinels not fully sending over to see yet because they don't understand what else is there. They didn't see anything else. The pressure's on now. Usually we'll get a trade in these rounds, Doug. One for one, but now 100 Thieves playing it very slow. They, they at least want to get what would be some separation out. Quiet down, cut the sound, and believe that they would rotate out. Also, you usually get the jet rotating away from the first kill. Tens has not done that, so they're gonna expect to see it. They're not gonna expect to see the op here. They've gotta draw noise to pull Tens away because he goes stuck, right? He's still sitting in that cubby. He can't move out. There's no flash on the side. Well, Breach is there now. Now that they've pulled over, now that Nitro has shown up, now they might have a chance at something sick with an excellent curveball. Asunu drops, three members remaining on the side of 100 Thieves, make that two, as Sentinels look to put 100 Thieves away. Steel and Hiko, no, oh. it's just Steel. Tens, Tens with the Blade Storm looking to take down the remaining members. Steel, what magic do you have in your hat? It's not gonna 